Bruce Campbell is in this film I was delighted to see yes and, he's got a cameo uh, uh, in a grand and glorious tradition of, of Bruce Campbell in your movies uh, he gets poked in the face with sticks he loves it he loves being harmed with sharp objects sticks primarily <laughs> it's a great motivator for Bruce you gotta work different are people gonna actors. recognize him because he is in some prosthetics you think yeah. his fans will all recognize him oh the voice is there I don't think the so voice. a lot of people didn't yeah. oh really yeah and oh. I think it's just about different techniques with different actors Zach thrives in a environment of freedom where uh -huh. he can riff and create and Bruce Campbell thrives in a pain filled environment <laughs> <laughs> now I know that back in the day on Evil Dead 2 for example you were the one who was actually poking him with the sticks oh absolutely but so, I, I don't have time for that I have to pay people to do that for me now, <laughs> <laughs> now, he's, now he's a big director <laughs> Get people to do that. Um, as a big Evil Dead fan, though, I, I did spot a, a number of references. I mean, obviously, people like Danny Hicks and uh, Betsy Baker, people like that, are in the film, which which is great to see. But right. consciously, did you put in, for example, towards the end, there's, there's a, a deadite feel to one of the characters, perhaps in terms of prosthetics. Uh, I don't want to say too much, but uh, actually, I don't even know what you mean. The, uh, the so uh, no, <laughs> uh, Evanora, Evanora towards um, the end. There's a, no. there's a dead eye feel, not just the way she's shot, but the way she's framed. It feels a bit like Army of Darkness. And there's a, a couple of lines in there that are almost taken uh, verbatim from from Evil Dead. Was that a conscious thing or no, or unconscious? No, it was unconscious. I guess. Yeah. I know. I had the same makeup team, KMB Effects, yeah. as Evil Dead Two, and maybe the same artists. You know, uh, Howard is great Howard Berger and Greg Kurtzman and the team but it's the same artist and the same director so you're probably going to get some of the same feel <laughs>